Hey everybody, John Rodden here again at uh, Paradise Point Golf Course. Uh, still on the subject of chipping, but we're going to talk about the complexity of the lies. Uh, the lie of the golf ball, the way it sits in the grass. I'm also assuming that you're not noodling it, you're not moving it, you don't have ball in hand. I am assuming that we're actually playing the rules of golf, which I think we should all do. Different topic, but the lie of the golf ball. Um, I carry four wedges. Pitching wedge is 48 degrees, gap wedge 52 sand wedge 56 and then I carry a lob wedge. Very, very rarely do I actually use the lob wedge. I'm going to go into from maybe a two inch discrepancy of where a ball is here and where a ball is there of how much different it can actually be. So as I discuss this, here I have actually a fluffy lie. Ball in hand, which is illegal, but ball in hand, golf ball is sitting magically, it's setting sexy, it looks beautiful, oh my god I can chip this in, I can make it, Beat my buddy out of 10 cents, but then on a foot and a half away, I have the nastiest, grossest, oh my God, how will I possibly get this golf ball up and down? The golf clubs you use, the situation are completely, completely different. So when we're talking about these two lies, although they're not far apart, the complexity is completely, completely different. One is sexy, one is nasty, one is gross, one is hideous, it's going to be hard to get it up and down. So when I look at the nice one, setting perfectly, I'm going to choose my gap wedge. doesn't matter to me which club you choose. If you remember the concept, maximum ground time, minimum air time. I'm going to choose this sexy one, get the gap wedge right here, and just go ahead and use points A, B, and C. On this lie right here, the one that's in bare dirt, not nice, not pretty, depending on the situation, what's going on, you may even putt this, but my advice to you is use a seven iron, use an eight iron, use something that doesn't have very much loft where I'm eliminating the possible disaster for you that you have to add those eights up. So if it's putter, use putter. Hope this helps. I'm John Rodden, PGA professional, and I hope you get better.